Hey guys, that's uh, Marshmallow FJR here. Um, that's interesting, old fire trucks. I'm going on the... Um, the Bikers for Boobies ride 2014. Ride? Right. All right. If you follow around behind the building, park behind the bikes, keep it tight. Okay. Thank you. Sure. Um, it's the Bikers for Boobies ride, 2014. There's supposed to be a lot of bikes here, maybe like 500. It's a. I'm here early. It doesn't leave till like 11:30. Registrations from 9 to 11. And supposedly this will be all busy right here. I'm so I'm somewhat early. <laughs> um, oh, I'm somewhat in the middle of the crowd. <laughs> yeah, it's just a hobby. I have a YouTube channel, so I when I go on the rise, I edit and then I just put it on there for people to watch. It's just a hobby. Yeah, sure. I need to register. Where do you register at? What's that? Where do you register at? They will come to you with the clipboard. Okay. Hey, clipboard lady! <laughs> oh. Hello. She's also the bra lady. Yeah, you need to wear the bra. Really? Yeah. Don't you want to wear the bra? Oh, yeah. Fill in the, t actually, the front and back of that. Okay. Take it as well, there's a lot more that showed up. All right, thanks. I got to pay for it. It's $25 for the first rider and then $10 more for the second. I don't have a passenger, so. Hi. Okay. And then um, they'll put your money down at the end. Okay. And then all this stuff is. Huh? We only take cash, right? No, we can take credit cards. Okay. And all this stuff's available? Okay. That's a good place to hook it. Oh, yeah. I love it. On the, we have a little GoPro camera. Okay. Yeah, I just do it as a hobby when I go on the rides. <laughs> it's a stress ball. I can use that for work. <laughs> yeah, I'm filming it. Don't be, don't be worried. Get some lipstick. How much are the hats? I'll take a beige one. I can wear it with golfing. Do I pay you now? You can pay for it when you pay for your shirt. Okay. Yeah, I can wear this one golfing. Cool. I can wear this one golfing. It looks awfully big for my head, though. Is this where you register at? Is this where you register at? Uh, yeah. Did you fill out paperwork? Yeah. I gave it to her over there. Yeah, she's been taking them down there too. She has, yeah. Okay. Here, put it on this one, I guess. I got a hat too. Yeah. I gave you 40. Okay. Is that it? Oh, yeah. What's that shirt? Yeah. Oh, uh, extra large. Extra large? Yeah. What? Oh, probably a large is fine, probably. Yeah, these are big, I guess. Oh, cool. Thanks. Hey, y'all. I'm going to get some of the bikes on this ride. I'm kind of early, so this is probably the first one. It's a trike. Goldwing trike. Another Goldwing. This is really interesting. It's running now, yeah. You run it, have run over? Yeah, it, I've got a, a portable charger. If it gets low, I'll charge it up again. Okay, so you'll never like snap pictures or I can. Or anything? I mean, I can with it. Yeah, I can snap pictures I mean, too. What do you do to do that though? You usually reach up and hit the button or? Yeah, I change the setting right here uh -huh. and then I use the top button to, to, to do the photo. Okay. I was just wondering how, how you control it. Please. I have a YouTube you know, channel. Gloves? Yeah, I can. Well, my gloves are, I'm missing my fingers. So my gloves are like, you know, 
I have padding and everything like that. I just don't have it covered my fingers. That's all. Yeah, so I'll show you what these gloves do. And there's one that controls the. Oh, I see. You just press the play button. Oh, that's cool, yeah. Everyone. You can also control your GoPro camera with it. Oh, you can? So, yeah, if you switch out yeah. the module, you can change it from single shot mode to multi shot mode, video mode. That's so interesting, yeah. Start, stop the recording all by tapping. The if I get a Hero 3, maybe I might get gloves like yeah, that. Yeah, you have to have a Hero 3. You have to have it. This to be the Wi Fi. Version. Yeah. That's the only drawback. This one doesn't have it. Right, yeah, yeah. Cool. All right, man. It's called Beer Tech Gloves in case you're looking for it. Okay, all righty. Here's a Suzuki V Strong. I've seen him before. He went on the um, Coats for Kids ride, I believe. There's going to be a lot of bikes here. I'm wearing too much equipment. <laughs> Lots of Harley riders here. Let's see how many people are here so far. And it's only 10 o'clock. And we don't leave till like 11.30. Oh, wow. So it's already half full. And we're here today for two very special reasons. One is to donate our time and resources to help put an end to breast cancer. All of us know someone. There's not a single person that I bet in this crowd does not know somebody that has gone through cancer treatment. And so we're here because we care and we want to support them and others like them. And uh, their fight is our fight. And so that's why we continue to do this year after year. This is our sixth year to do this. And the second reason that we here are here today is to honor and show support for those who have been diagnosed. We are truly honored to have several individuals who have battled breast cancer in their lifetime. And they're here with us today. And I'd like to think in some small part, it's because you're here and I'm here, but they're here. And so we, walk, we ride walk and we crew just to keep that idea and that support going and I want to introduce to you uh, Dolores Miller is she down here? Okay. Uh, I have Carol Arnold this is a very special survivor today is her 20th year anniversary Thanks for getting us all here together today safely. 
please be with us on our ride. Please be with us on our ways home, on the highways and the byways. Keep us all safe. In your precious name, O Lord. Amen. 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 Here we go, y'all. Bikers for Boobies 2014. It goes all the way around the building. <laughs> this is going to be great. <laughs> there we go. Oh, well, they're leaving five minutes early, 11.25. This is great because um, it's all police escorted and um, you can run the red lights. That's what I like about it. Just run all the red lights and <laughs> people have to stop for you. It'll probably pick up in speed later on, I'm sure. I'm about um, a quarter of the way in the group. So you can see the end of the group right there. I don't know if you can see that. So it goes all the way around the building. I'm, I'm guessing it's probably three to 500 bikes. I can't be exact, but there's, I have a nephew that works for that ambulance company. <laughs> oh, there's a fire truck ahead of us, looks like. Oh wow, that's cool. It's great because they block all the traffic for us. See, like right here, they blocked the service road. <laughs> and see the lights red up ahead, but they've already had the intersection blocked off. So we just ride right through it. It's a greatness. They got all the intersections blocked off. <laughs> I love it. I wish I could ride to work like this. Just me. <laughs> Look, they have the highway shut down even. Look at this. They have the whole highway shut down. Interstate 75. <laughs> awesome. I don't know if you can see this, but there's a fire truck. There's more bikes up ahead, and then there's a fire truck. And then there's just hundreds of bikes behind me. And look, we've got traffic stopped or slowed down on the other side almost. This is just a nice, easy pace. See, they've got all the highway entrances blocked off, but I guess they just stopped. Oh. That was nice of them. They pulled over. But they have the highway. Well, they opened up the highway now, it looks like. they. But they have a couple of cars on the just the one side. That's interesting. Close the whole highway off. I've never been on a ride that they've closed the highway off. Looks like we're exiting off here on... Texas 5, so. I don't know how those four cars got through, but they have the whole highway almost shut down pretty much. That's cool, the cars pulled over for us, that's nice. Making a ride on industrial. Hello, Mr. Officer. got to get over now. Oh. He's got good brakes. 
just tell those cars to get over. It's awesome, this. I would just love to follow him. <laughs> I can't, though. <laughs> Now we made a left on Farm Road 982. We're going north now to uh, Princeton. And there's a sign there, Princeton six miles. Now the line's shuffled a little bit and I have a street glide up on my right now. Pretty much have the whole city shut down for us. The city of this is the city of Princeton. Making a left on 599, I think. Five fifty-nine. This is Lake Levon, but it's just dried up. Because we're in a we're in a pretty bad drought here. Now we're making a left on Farm Road 496. Now we're making a ride on Farm Road 493. All police escorted so far. I just ran a stop sign. <laughs> now we're making a ride on. I can't see it. 1827 still south. Still police escorted. It's been a long ride. It's been probably 45 minutes so far. Because it's 12.41 now. And we left at 11.35, I think. Wow, this is a longer ride than I thought. It's pretty. It's... I've never been on this ride. I've been on this road before, but going in the opposite direction. That's a nice little town. We're almost at our destination now. Wow, it's, I can't believe that. It's been, it's been, that was a 90 minute ride. That's amazing. That's the longest police escort ride I've been on so far, 90 minutes. Because it's 12.57, we started like 11.30. I remember I was here the last time was another, uh, another ride we had to park over here in the grass. But since I'm kind of in the front, uh, I don't have to do that today. <laughs> it's the uh, VFW in McKinney, post 2150. I'm just gonna park up here. Go ahead. Sorry, I didn't mean to scare you. <laughs> Should be a pull out right here. Put it on the center stand. All right, y'all. Come on in, you got room. It's a nice road glide. That's, oh, it's been a great ride, y'all. I, I had a lot of fun. Take care.